はい。So we、uh, are、um, at the, the postscript to the first letter. Okay. Yes. The name mark is the same, but I want to answer with an amen. So, so uh, one of the cryptic chazals is that somebody who says amen is greater than the person who makes the blessing. Because that is accepting the, what it says. In other words, the person、uh, who hears the bracha accepts what the other person says, and evidently that is、um, significant. Um, and I guess it's going to explain it. Therefore, I will conclude with accepting things. We see that Nosibol Chavero is very, very great. And I'm assuming, although I'm not 100% sure, is that、um, the, uh, uh, the answer to Amen to a bracha is a kind of Nosibol phenomenon. Because the person who's answering Amen to the bracha is actually. Um, is actually um, He's actually accepting what his friend is doing as opposed to doing it himself. So maybe there's some noticeable part of it. I'm not sure if that's what he means to say. But,、uh, but here he, he says another chiddush, regardless of whether that's what he's trying to say with a man, which is a big chiddush. But here, k i l a m a l a m e v'haf to recha kamocha. n o s i b o l chaveru is a higher level than v'haf to recha kamocha. Because v'haf to recha kamocha is an attitude. k i b a m a s e gam k e i Because、uh, uh, Nosibo is also uh, the, uh, uh, bear, sharing the burden, not just in attitude, but in practice. Odomat was that, or it's at least similar to Bafir and Gomoka. We have a Mida Rashi's Lanogas a club. Somebody wants to be a leader, then they have to have the concept of Nosibo o im Javero. I don't know have, if our, any of our secular leaders have such a trait, but certainly. A religious leader has to have that、uh, that ima n o c h i b a t s a r a type relationship with his、uh, his flock. Um, anything which is a, a, a more broad category, a more inclusive category, get is rewarded more. Okay, Roy learned behind the ambing yachts on Oskimba as Oskim, therefore, everything which you're involved with, so he shall shackles and Osiba and Kabeiro. Which is relevant at all to n o s i b o Chabero, Kidai v e n a c h o l u t a r e v a m a c h s h a v a b e z e It's best if you're doing anything like that, helping out somebody,、um, doing something which is a favor for somebody, have in mind your n o s i b o Chabero. Luis Ragel b e m a l a s n o s i b o Chabero, and to accustom itself to realizing the loftiness of this purpose. And with this, the, the, what he does will be in, in part of the overarching category of this high level of functioning. And with this, we'll have hope in, over the course of time. Not just to practice this, but to sense what a high level this is. We'll be praiseworthy. In this lofty manner, interesting. We can understand why、uh, the, the many of the Jewish leaders were shepherds. Well, a simple reason is that、um, they could have c h o s e a low type of work. In order to sustain themselves in a manner which was humble. As Inter Rab Dessler says an interesting thing, he says that Chazal normally made their Parnassa from manual labor. And the reason they made their, 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 their Parnassa manual labor is because a person who makes his living off of his mind never knows if he's giving more than he's getting. Because if you're a lawyer and you charge $500 an hour, you have no way of knowing. If the value you're giving your client is $500 an hour worth, if you're、uh, any, type, any type of activity, which is brain activity as opposed to physical activity, you cannot make sure the scale is inclined towards giving more than taking. So, 
the, that's why they would do things like being a shepherd, being a farmer. Rabbi, uh, Rabbi Yoshua is famous, he made needles. So uh, everybody had a, a, a menial labor in order to make sure they're giving more than they were taking. That's how he understands the concept of Yagiya Kapecha, Chisokal Ashrechem Tovlov. If you need your handiwork, for your handiwork, if you're praiseworthy, and Chazal say, Go to an enemy, you get a cup of Yosemir Yishamayim. Person who gets a pleasure, benefit from, in other words, to get their Arnasa from the handiwork, it's great, a person who's God fearing because they make sure they're giving more than they're taking. That's you can make right. it. It's, uh, you have to have equal weights. If, you, if you're just charging money and you don't know if what you're giving is worth it, right. then you perhaps have cheated the person in the weight yes. of the, yeah, you so, know, like, yeah. Right. If it's, you're, it's the same minion. Yes, the, the tan, tan, something tangible is easier to assess. So, but right. so he doesn't say that here. But first, he just says Anova. But the oh, he says, An Akianova Mevil de Rachmanus. Humility brings a person to mercy. A Gaiva who have a because uh, pride is loving oneself and no one else. Paymarkish but Sarz will so, an arrogant person, prideful person. Does not feel the anguish of anybody other than himself. He don't know say bolim chaber. He doesn't carry the burden with his friend. Therefore, they accustom themselves to uh, sheep herding, urachem alatzon, and to have mercy on the sheep. And to direct them with uh, with, with uh, softness and with grace, as is appropriate. Have they already had in their nature to be, be merciful to creatures that cannot talk? And they'll be already trained to, uh, to, um, to uh, govern the, this unique nation and go in the ways of God. I wanted to uh, uh, clarify this matter of the brick of sapphire. Everything where Kosh Baruch Hu uses, so to speak, with something which is active or tangible, the Pashtus, the Pashtus HaKosuv, and point to simple understanding of the, the scripture. This is the way to understand it. Everybody, uh, all the philosophers uh, agree that a per, that intellect about intellectual uh, concepts that they bring to eternity. In other words, Plato, for example, I assume is referring to how that although the the material uh, uh, substance the uh, uh, does not transcend the the uh, a person's lifetime, but the ideas, the form. The Tzuras versus the Chomer does transcend the person's life, and that is what exists after a person dies. The the so according to what, what the author seems to be saying is that what's important from a philosophical point viewpoint is what takes place in your mind. That's what makes your Tzura. That's what makes your form. Those are in fact ideas, and those ideas survive, transcend the person's physical death. But things which take place in the world of mice and the worlds of deed. They, according to a philosophical perspective, would remain in the world of deed and not be taken with you, right? Just like can't take the money with you, you can't take the actions yes. with you. Okay. Uh, right. it, when it comes to activity, the person can't really perceive that there's going to be something remaining afterwards. But if in the, by the word of God a deed has been done, this is not uh, something which is astonishing. Because, uh, no. Sorry, I got that wrong. Well. It says that Akash Baruch created the world with 10 statements. So Akash Baruch speech created the world, whatever that means. But it means that with Hashem's uh, uh, can, met with his words, accomplish action. Right? That, that, that doesn't, it's not astonishing because you shouldn't do anything. But what you can't understand is how can the ultimate uh, uh, spiritual entity 
produce Tachlis Agashmi, the ultimate material entity, like our lowly world. No, no creature can grasp that. We have this, the Soro, we have this tradition. That not only is Hashem created, but the primary way a person is judged is by what he does. As he brings here from Abbas, Hakolafi Rova Maaseh. Now, the Rambam says, and I believe it's based on the Gemara, Kiddushin, I forget where, that God of Talmud, why is Talmud Torah greater? Shemadeli De Maisa, right? In other words, uh, the, ta- the Talmud is greater, the greatest mitzvah, only because it brings a person to do more stuff. Not because of the learning in and of itself. Rather, it brings mm-hmm. a person to do stuff. And the more a person is meticulous in fulfilling the Maisa, who are Kadosh Yoser, is holier. I guess it's is either a, 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 a schmooze he gave or a um, book that he wrote, a, a pamphlet, an essay he wrote. So, several matters which are material, the Kachbem and Yanim Ruchdim, in which are wrapped up spiritual things. Rami, when he's loving, lofty, and high. The Karavel HaSeichel, we wrote this to bring understanding. Ech Shemaseya Mitzvos, how the acts of Mitzvos, had seen Mipi Agbura, came out from HaKadosh Baruch Hu, the Tachli Saruchnius, with the ultimate spirituality, no Kelavin, and it's easy to understand. Kiprimi Yusomi Tachli Saruchnius, that in their inner core, they are the ultimate ruchlis. The low ode, not only this, Ela Slainu. But in order to make a true sh- by us, we should appreciate that the tachlis of ruchlis is accomplished by actual, tangible activity. Here, like it says, uh, I forget the exact question of the apostles, but anyway, there is. Uh, 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 evidently, there the the Goelis talks about the advantage of activities. Kasvat Torah, Kasvat Torah, the fun of his bach, living in Sapir, lives chira. B'chayin Hashem, b'chayin Hashem In other words, the whole Torah is full of these anthropomorphisms, which are Kadosh Baruch Hu uses the world of Maisa in order to teach us that everything which is important has to be accomplished not just in Machshava, not just in Dibor. But also in actual has to find activity of some sort to uh, cement it um, and have to have the have the impact which is meant to have in the world of Maisa. Um, from this, we ourselves will go out diligently to fulfill the aspect of tangible activity. So this was the will of this is God's intent. So evidently, the writer, the, the writer brought down a sefer. That before Kadosh Baruch Hu, speech is like deed. That's obvious. Also, things that are spiritual are uh, are, are made. They have to be made. Because they have to be made by Kadosh Baruch Hu from nothingness. And certainly, they are. Actual tangible activities, which come, which produce the actual tangible world. Avul Omar, but to say, ki achinu she love is rak yivari nasem aseh that the novelty by Kodesh Baruch was that with words acts are performed. Say pasha, that's obvious. Other Abba, a pelu echiot sami many is rak tachlis hageshem. The 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 question is how the ultimate material existence came out. In other words, the things which are, um, uh, which are, uh, I guess, uh, I'm not sure what he means, it can mean either the ultimate distance, the ultimate distance in material existence, how that came out from a Kodesh Baruch Hu. I think it's more than that. I think that it means that the Tachli suggestion that there's a purpose for Gashmius. That Hashem could make, could make things happen, activities and, and creation, that's not a big deal. But what the Kiddush of the Bria is that the purpose of the Bria is not fulfilled except by doing things. And that you cannot fulfill yourself or creation just by working on your attitude or even on your speech. 
You have to go out and do. And the purpose of going out and doing in its highest level, says the Altamagam, is nice to bear tangibly a burden with somebody else. So that is the other mice in general is necessary in order to fulfill one's perfection, the perfection of the world, but it also is that it also is intended evidently for no Sabon Khabero. Maybe that's uh, what he means when he says that the Haftalarecha Kamoicha is like a a thought uh, right. idea. There's yeah. no Maisa. Whereas no Sabaol you have to really do something. In Kelm, they used to sell on Simchas Kaira the right to clean the base matters for the entire year. That was a tremendous, the great privilege, was a privilege to be able to clean the base matters. Mm. Now, in Slabotka, they probably would not allow the Bachim to clean the base matters. <laughs> so it's very antithetical to Rachim and Musr. But right. in Kelm, that, and that was going to be, the, uh, uh, because it was Nosy Balam Chavero. Right. Because this is a, a, a by cleaning up. Right. Even though it seems to be gosh, this evidence is with the Ruchnius, Mikoshke and Mysa Mitzvah, so these are Mitzvahs, the Rak by a Mikne Kachli so Ruchnius. Only the, through uh, material functions will we actually acquire the Ruchnius, Vadvarim, Arukim, and the thing, these are long issues, which of course means that Mimer Bayes is also going to speak about this. <laughs> this also is what the Chinuch says that Adam. Uh, oh. lefi palo, pulo, exactly. Right, that's a mitzvah. Person is drawn, right. is drawn after his actions. That's our answer to Christianity, basically. Right, yeah. you got to do it. Right. Okay, so we'll start right. Armor Base next week. Very good. Thank you very much. Yeah. Have a good day. Have a good week.